Hello everybody, this is HasmacGamer9842 here. So today, um, I actually recently got into a new cubing competition, so I thought it would be a good time to um, disassemble this and clean it up a little bit. So that's exactly what we're going to do. Um, yeah. So as you can see here, um, we have uh, the cube, these alignment tools, a screwdriver, and a manual as well as uh, an adjustment piece. And I just have these here because um, I think these might be helpful. And I also have the instruction set because I actually have not, is this the one? Used too many of these tools. Like the this tool I've not used. So it'll be interesting. So first things first. Um, oh, we're also gonna be using my favorite lunar lubricant. First things first, um, take this thing apart. Here, um, oh, um, That actually is not the worst angle. I'm gonna just do this. This will probably be the best. So I'm gonna take these all out. Yeah, these are all a bit gunky. You can see some. Uh, the camera isn't really picking up, but there's a lot of like dirt buildup. It looks like uh, that was probably when I first got the cube, and I don't think I actually ever cleaned it out before. So, let's just do it now. Get this finished nice and clean. But yeah, so I am going to a Rubik's competition. It will take place March 12th. It'll be the same thing as my last one. But there'll be only three events um, in it. There will be uh, the... Um, it was the... I think it's a three. It's definitely the, there's definitely a three by three event. I think the two by two and the pyramid are the events that I'll be taking place in. Um, I won't be competing in the uh, B. I'm only competing in A, and I will not be going um, for the next day's competition, which is big and blind cubes. And I'm not too good at those. And plus, I will have family in town that those days, so I'm just going to stick to um. A. So that'll be pretty fun. Um, I w oh, best case scenario, I bring my computer with me and hopefully I will edit and post the videos same day. That is the most ideal case. It probably won't be up for a day or two after. Until a day or two after of it. Because editing and processing everything. Granted, it's not as big as the competition. So hopefully it won't be as bad. But yeah, that'll probably take some time. Um, this is my first time cleaning this cube, and yeah, so, and I'm sorry I haven't been posting a lot lately, I've been busy with school, school really got big, like, very busy, very fast, but hopefully I'll be able to post more in the future, I have a break coming up, so that, that'll be good. But yeah, so currently just um cleaning this. This is my um clean pile over here. This is my dirty. Oh wow, yeah. This is like real dirty. I'm glad I'm cleaning this. This will probably be 10 times smoother when it's done. But yeah, so I'm going to pause the video and, um, yeah, uh, I'll see you once I'm done, uh, doing all these individual pieces. So I'll show you what I'm going to do for the next step. See you then. 
Bye. Oh. oh wait. We are back. Uh, actually, so um, let's get back into this. So I finished this, and now we're gonna focus on the centerpiece. So how we're going to do it, and this is the way I'm doing it because I looked at the uh centerpieces earlier, and I was like, wow, these don't look that good. So. Um, because I actually did lubricate these, and they're not looking too shabby at the moment, so I'm glad I'm cleaning this out. Um, it'll be good. Uh, let's see. Uh, flash is disabled, I guess. Let's see if I could turn it on. Um, no, I can't. Oh well. So, oh well. Um, I'm going to uh take off these center pieces because they look like they're a bit messy. These seem the these like. They're strong magnets, because this is a maglev cube. <laughs> oh my gosh. What the heck? Oh wow, yeah, that magnet, oof, there's a lot of stuff on that. I'm glad I'm going to be able to wipe this down. <laughs> oh my gosh. This is like... Wow. Is this like... Let's see. Okay, good. So that's off. And let's. Oh no. I'm gonna have to isolate that from the magnets. Oh. Look at my fingers. That's from the magnets. I'll get to the magnets in a second. Let's get the blue thing out of here. So, there's like not a real good way on how I'm supposed to do this, go about this. So, I'm gonna just move those off my area. Get the cup thingy. Wow, yeah, this is like, ooh. Get the screw, make sure it's nice and clean. Uh, yeah, this is like, uh, super messy. Now, wow, these are strong magnets. Oh my goodness. Wow, yeah, I can't get these apart. Cause that might be a problem. Let's see if this works. Okay, so if you have a maglev cube, just keep in mind that this might be not the easiest thing to do at all. How about, yeah, let's try this. Oh, wait, this might work. Yeah, this is working, I think. Let's go. I did it.
that must mean this side. Wow, they really repel. Oh, what the heck? Really? It's in. And then where did it go? I had it. I literally had it. Oh, there it is. Um. There's probably more efficient ways of doing this, but this is how I'm doing it. Okay. Yeah, that's not in far enough. Okay, how about now? This is time consuming. I'm gonna just use this Almost. That's like right on par. Yeah. And that is it actually. So put the cap on this one. And I'll see you guys um once I'm done with the rest. Yeah. Back everybody. Okay, so Excuse me. Um, this is I finished wiping it down. It took I took down each bit. Um, and yeah, this is correct. So what we're gonna do? Darn, did I? Uh, that should fix it. Um, <laughs> I'll be back in a second. Back. Okay. Sorry about that. So, um. Yeah, this is all correct. So now we will start reassembling the cube. Um, if only I can find some of the correct parts. Oh. So that goes there. I need a red, um, red, yellow. Please let this be the right one. It is, actually. I don't know why this doesn't want to. Okay, there. Yeah. Um. Paper towels just falling off at the moment. There. Get the yellow. What is this face? Oh, orange. I was like, huh? That that fell off. It looked like. So, the yellow orange. Uh, the yellow, orange, blue corner. That's yellow, orange, green. Here, uh, that's... Yeah, that's the one. Here it is. Okay, the blue, orange, green, yellow, where is it? Uh, here it is. Yes, let's go almost there with the reassembly.
and yeah so let's do red first yeah and and then green and I actually did take the sticker off it was peeling off for a while so I was like why not just do it now while I'm giving this thing a nice clean let's do this piece um very dry which is why I'm going to um take off all these center pieces like not the actual centerpiece but the um but like the cover for it and just confirm that I have my centers exactly how I enjoy them this I enjoy it in a very specific way but yeah maybe in the future I could post some more maintenance videos like on a, just me doing this Let's get my lubricant for the cube and just one drop on it. Okay. One drop's all you should need. Where did that go? Oh, there. One drop. And yeah, so I'm just getting this ready for the competition in March, and hopefully I'll get some official PBs done, which would be good. Like, I think I'm going to get a lot. Uh, my goal is to um get sub-30 across my, like, on all events, on both single and average. And I know the pyraminx and the 2x2 two two are already sub-30, but, um, I want it for the 3x3 three three mainly, because that's around what I'm averaging, about 10 seconds faster than my last event. Okay. Better, but we still need the main lubricants right here. One, two, three... Four, five, six. So then there's about seven drops in that one. Instantly getting so much better. Let's. And. Let's see how shiny that is. I'm going to add one, two more drops. Okay. Oh, that's much better. Yeah, that's so much better. I'm glad I did that. So smooth. Yeah. I might lube it like the, like a day or two before the event. Maybe at the event, depending on what I need. I'll make sure to bring this all. But yeah. um, Thank you for watching my video. <laughs> I appreciate it a lot. Um, 
the event's going to be pretty fun. And yeah, I'm excited to be there and post that video. Thank you guys for watching. Please like and subscribe if you have not already. And yeah, uh, see you guys later. Bye.